Well, you made it, church. Made it, family. Listen to this real quick. Let God lead you. Psalm 23, David's writing, verse number two. He says, he makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. Yeah. He will lead you through the storm. He'll give you peace. Not only peace, but his peace. God, people, God is the very embodiment of peace. He's the Lord of peace. And he will lavishly pour out his peace upon you. As you walk with him, as you talk with him, as you commune with him, as you fellowship with him, he'll give you his peace. He'll give you him. Like Gideon in Judges 6, chapter verse number 24, in times of fear and chaos, build an altar of peace on your heart. Let God remind you of his peace. So that you can choose to focus on his word and you can choose to focus on his peace and let it overtake you. Let peace be the cloak that gives you uh, the firm foundation or become the foundation. Let his peace then follow you or pursue after you. Let it surround you in every season of your life. Let his favor overshadow you. Let God cause you to lie down and rest in green pastures. And let his word steal your storm. God wants to steal the life storms in your life. Choose to let God comfort and give you peace in your heart. Let God give you peace in every area of your life. I want you to choose to be free in him. Be free from torment of the past. Choose to turn to him and be set free forever. Because if you have not accepted Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, if you have fallen away from him, I want you to simply say this prayer. Repeat after me, if you will. Dear Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, I repent of my sin. I turn to you. Father, I receive your Son, Jesus Christ, as my Lord and Savior. I believe that Jesus Christ died and rose just for me. I believe that his blood washes me and cleanses me from all unrighteousness. Father, in you, I am set free. And Father, through your blood, through your son Jesus, my past is history and my future is bright. Father, in you, I'm made new. Father, in you, I am complete. Father, in you, I am made whole. Father, in you, I am restored. Father, in you, I am free. I surrender every area of my life. I give my life unto you now, forever. In Jesus' name, amen. You made it. Ooh, it's about to be amazing.